my um my uh HR department and I declared my home my hetero uh, my homosexuality like two months ago, bro. It felt great. It felt great looking right into my fucking HR's eye and being like, Yes, you know, I just just so that I am further, you know, part of this team in every way possible and everyone understands where I'm coming from. I am leaving a, you know, a certain type of lifestyle. All right. Sorry about that. I, you know, I, I thought I, I thought I pissed you off with that gay comment. No, 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 you didn't. The men. So you guys are gay, like gay porn. You guys got to let these kids in, the gay ones. Penis. And he's a little bit rough. He's a little bit hard to take. Other guys, penises. And one guy was talking about shoving things in his ass. And uh, the other guys were talking about licking his wiener, his penis. Yeah, the amazing atheist stuck something in up his rear end, too, because he wanted to find out whether that would be pleasurable or not. <laughs> the excessive need inside of the man. Oh, my sexual exploits here around men. My sexual exploits uh, around, uh, you know, my friends or, uh, you know, at the bar, shoving things up their asses and... Uh, you know, rubbing sperm on their face and stuff like that. Hey, if MGTOW's going that gay way, then fine. Let it go that gay way. Let, let the guys shove things up their, their back ends if they want to sleep with other men. You know, size their penises up and that stuff. You know, guys that shove shit up their rear ends. One's a homosexual because he is a homosexual. Talk about other men's cocks. Gay for me. Gay porn and shit. Like gay porn. Penis. Other guys' penises. Your penis. Penises in general. His penis his penis boys having a wank sexual feelings about boys oh sperm on their face i'm a fag <laughs> i'm just a just a regular guy oh my god you're gay months went by and i could feel my hormones starting to change i was always horny i started watching porn but it did nothing for me i then began to masturbate but again nothing I decided to go online and sex chat with strangers to see how it would make me feel. I chatted with a few guys, and the feeling was incredible. It made me feel so bad. I would take sexy pictures and rejoice every time I received a compliment on my hot body. I felt wanted, which is exactly the feeling I was longing for. I then began chatting with this new guy. He was different. He was funny and cute, so I was purely looking for something sexual. I spoke to this guy for about a month and finally decided that we should meet. A week before meeting the other guy, I started feeling knots in my stomach. I started talking to this guy who was married with kids. He was looking for an NSA, that is a no-strings-attached relationship, just like me. He was so smooth with his words and somehow convinced me to meet him a week after we started chatting. I continued talking to this guy and he turned out to be a decent human being. We would talk daily for four weeks and met up to three times a week just to make out. This guy had a way with his words, and it was just so hard to say no. So yesterday I went to see him, but this time it was in a hotel. He was so passionate, he kissed every part of my body. I gave him a BJ, and it made him come within a matter of seconds. I gave him a BJ, and it made him come within a matter of seconds. I gave him a BJ, and it made him come within a matter of seconds. I gave him a BJ, and it made him come within a matter of seconds. Hello people, the Mad Changi here with a special announcement for MGTOW. Now, uh, I've been uh, told about, and this has been brought to my attention before, about this creepazoid named Convertible MGTOW, that this guy goes around and he doxes people, he stalks people. And I notice he has a particular fixation on transgender people in general, and I've been wondering, well what's the deal here? Why is this guy obsessed with trans people? Especially, you know, especially I noticed this guy showed up when I had, um, uh, Sayomi and Nadia Faith on my live stream. And this, and, and when I had Sayomi on my live stream before, he showed up then too. So obviously this guy is following, uh, these trans people around, particularly Sayomi. You got it going on, girl. 
and I've been wondering, well, so what's the deal with this here? Are they, they really th threaten about trans people who identify as MGTOW, or is there something deeper going on here? Well, here, let me just cut straight, uh, cut through the bullshit. Traversable MGTOW is gay. He's attracted to men. He's in the closet, and he's in denial. And uh, I just seen a screenshot that with proof that he's gay. He follows a gay porn account on Facebook. And uh, if this guy continues to keep showing up and harassing people, especially on my live stream, I'm going to share this screenshot on a, during a live stream. So just to let you all know, Traversable Big Tao is a flaming homosexual. There's nothing wrong with being a homosexual. Just please come out of the co uh, closet and, uh, you know, be happy with yourself. Quit trying to police other people to cover up for your own gayness. That's all I have to say about that. Traversable MGTOW, you're gay.